they should make these into fidget toys. If you have seen my vlog comparing stop box pedals and multi effects processors, you would have known that one of the drawbacks of having stop box pedals and building pedal boards is that you would have to deal with cable management and a lot of cables. It's a good thing that there are now experts that offer this kind of service. Building pedal boards and cables. Hi, what's up? Welcome to my channel. I'm Aaron. I play the guitar and this is ASTV. Welcome to another episode of What's Up Wednesdays and in this video, we are going to talk about one of the best providers of cables and cable management here in the Philippines, Geardrop PH. This is not a sponsored video. I bought all of these items on my own and would just like to give a testimony about Geardrop's quality service and items. So let's get into it. I started with my first pedal board about 10 or 11 years ago. As a student, the primary hurdle of course is saving up for the pedals. The other struggle is evident in this photo, the pedal board itself and the cables. By the way, a huge shout out and many thanks to Kuya Viji for providing me my very first pedal board. They make travel and cooking vlogs, do check out their channels, links down below. My pedal board went through a couple of versions and fast forward to 2022, my pedal board was finally able to achieve its best and cleanest version. The OC personality in me is now satisfied knowing that all of my patch cables are built with quality and are all of the same brand. All my patch cables are made by Geardrop. I met Geardrop or Gabs last 2019 at our Facebook page Pedalboard PH. That was the time I transitioned to my GC Rockboard Kirk Mini and Boss MS3. Geardrop makes customized cables from quality materials. The necessity for customized cables came because of MS3. My Boss MS3 is a multi-effect switcher. Being a switcher, it has effects loops which are comprised of effects sends and returns which are positioned close to each other. All these patch cables which I had been using before weren't cut for the job. Get it? Cut for the job? <laughs> There are no factory-made patch cables readily available in guitar shops that could fit both in terms of length and plug size. Geardrop has a lot of plugs to choose from and you could specify the length you need. My patch cables are square plugs because they're square. These allow me to fit the most pedals on my pedal board because of their flat head design. I'm confident that these cables will last me a lifetime. The service I haven't availed from them yet is having my pedal board built. The service means that I would have to mail to them my pedals and my board and then they will be the ones to custom fit and build the board. I live far from them and availing of this service would mean that I won't be able to make use of my pedal board for about 2-4 to four weeks. You may ask, just how good is Geardrop? Well, they are so good that Mason Marangella of Vertex Effects himself acknowledged their skills. Here are some of the cables and boards they have made. Now, these are what you can call quality, right? If you're from around here, give their service a try. Visit their Facebook page, like and follow Geardrop, and tell them that I sent you there. Again, links down below. So there you have it. Cable management and pedal board building is no longer a problem because of people like Geardrop. You can rest assured that there's always a tailor fit solution to your cable and pedal board needs. So if you find value in this video, please hit the like button, leave a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell as well so that you'll be updated the next time I upload a video. Stay tuned for more episodes of What's Up Wednesdays. Stay safe and I will see you in the next video. Peace out.